Hey everyone, welcome back to the CopQuest YouTube channel. My name is David, I'm the manager of Agency Sales, and today we're gonna to be talking about some popular duty holsters from Safari Land. So, without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so first up we have a ever popular level three holster. So this is the Safari Land 6360, and this particular one is the RDS, so that's the red dot sight. So as you can tell up here, you got this nice big bump. That's to accommodate your red dot sight, uh, such as your Trijicon RMR, Leopold Delta, uh, Sig Pro One. I think there, you know, there's a few different ones, but anyway, uh, this will work in it. If you're not running an RMR, you can do just a regular 6360. So what makes it a 6360? Well, as I said before, it's a level three. So first, you're gonna rotate down this SLS bale, and uh, don't worry, I'll step closer in a moment so you can see. And then you have to defeat the ALS nub, which is back here. ALS is automatic locking system. It locks onto the ejection port of your firearm. That's why these are molded specific to each firearm. Uh, this particular one that I'm holding is for the Sig Sauer P320 full size with a Streamlight TLR1. But you can get it for Glocks, Staccato P Duo, uh, Smith & Wesson M&P. There's, there's a few different options. Just this particular one I'm holding is for the uh, the six hour but uh, let's check it out so what you'll do is you'll get your grip and then you take your thumb you'll push down and rotate forward that exposes the ALS nub right up here which then you take your thumb and you rotate it back I know this is a little awkward of an angle but I wanted to do the best one that I could to show you guys what it looks like because normally this would be sitting on your hip but uh, I hope that helps. Another cool feature about these holsters is this dust cover up here. So this is meant to protect your very expensive optic from uh, dust, debris, whatever it may be. Um, if you're going to drop that much money on an optic, you want to you want to protect it. But anyway, so as you're pushing down and rotating forward on the self-locking system bale, it actually rotates that dust cover forward, allowing you to uh, find your ALS nub, which then you can deactivate that and draw your, your firearm and uh, do your work. So now finishes. Um, this particular one is STX basket weave. You can also get it in STX tactical, which is going to be a, a bit rougher. Think of uh, like texturing on your, your walls. Um, you can also do plain finish, which is going to be a bit smoother. Then there's going to be FDE brown, so flat dark earth. You can do a foliage green, an OD green, or if you want to wrap it in Cordura and have that nice fuzzy feeling and uh, reduce the infrared signature, you have that option as well. So I hope you enjoyed that. Let's move on to the next popular one that we're going to be talking about. All right, so up next, we've got a 6390. RDS holster. So um, first off, uh, I want to talk about the finish. So the first one was the STX basket weave. This is the STX plane, so it's nice and smooth um, so you can get into the slippery situations. Um, but going into the features now. So one of the big glaring features that you may notice that's different between this 6390 and the 6360 is there's no self-locking system bail up here so this is a level one holster okay and for level one all you need is your automatic locking system okay so as you're going to get your grip you'll squeeze back and draw your firearm now you might be asking well what about the dust cover so your uh, dust cover is going to go forward as you draw out your firearm by the optic. So uh, even though it's a very expensive item, it's pretty robust and it can handle knocking this thing out of the way. Um, I wouldn't recommend it, but some people like taking this off because they're not a fan of the dust cover. Uh, you're able to do that. I personally wouldn't do that if I had a, a red dot on mine, but uh, you have that ability to do so. Uh, the 6390 is a mid-ride duty holster. If you wanted a low ride, so you wanted to have an inch and a half drop instead of the uh, half inch, 
you would get a 6395. And then conversely, if you wanted a low ride level three holster, it would be a 6365 instead of a 6360. And uh, there you are, here's a 6390 RDS holster. Let's go on to the next one. All right, so up next, this one is actually a slightly different than the, uh, the previous 6390. This is a 6354 DO. So instead of being the red dot sight, so RDS, DO uh, stands for Dr. Optic. So this one is more designed to fit a specific type of optic, but you're able to accommodate a few other ones if you're a uh, similar size to the Dr. Optic uh, optic. I know it's tongue twister, and uh, but anyway. So this particular 6354 DO is wrapped in black Cordura. So I had mentioned that that's one of the options that you could do with the red dot sight holster. Well, that's what you got here. Um, the purpose of Cordura is to reduce the infrared signature, plus it looks cool. You can do black, uh, OD green, there's a tan, and a multicam. So, I mean, you wanna look cool when you're out in the field operating, this might be a good option for you. Uh, going on. You'll notice that there is no SLS bail. That's because this is a level one holster with automatic locking system only. So as you get your grip, you'll squeeze back and it will release and you can draw your firearm. Moving on, you'll notice that there's no belt loop adapter on this one. So the cool thing about a 6354 DO is you have a couple options. You can either go with the QLS 19 fork, or you can do what's referred to as the MS30, which is going to be the combination of the QLS 19, the QLS 22, and a 6070 UBL, which is a mid-ride belt loop adapter. Uh, you can get these in light bearing or non-light bearing, your choice. But uh, ultimately, this would make a fantastic duty weapon for those of you who want to look cool and have a functional holster. Uh, so I want to thank you all for watching. Be safe out there. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. We're trying to put out fun and exciting content that's very knowledgeable all the time. So be safe. Talk to you soon.